and welcome to another episode of Let's Fly. Today I want to show you how I start up my Mooney M20R in my home cockpit. Please note I'm no flight instructor, no real life pilot, so please don't take this video for real life flying or training. And a word to my checklist, they are from the internet and I've adopted them so I can use them in my simulator. And don't wonder, there is a strange cap on my head, it's the head cam, so you can see everything from my perspective. We're at Cardiff Airport in wonderful Wales at the General Aviation Parking. So we assume we've done our outside check, so let's start. Pre-flight checklist. Alternate static air off. Gear selector down. Ignition switch off. Master switch on. Now we check fuel quantity, battery voltage and vacuum. Okay, checked. Pyto heat on and off is checked. Trim neutral, flaps down. Yeah, okay, they're down. Master switch off. Before start checklist, pre-flight is completed. Passengers are briefed, seatbelts are fastened, cabin door is closed and locked. Parking brake is set. Fuel selector is set to the right tank. Now let's drain it with the uh, can simulate it. Fuel selector to the left one, gas to drain for 5 seconds, I can simulate this. Gear selector down. Circuit breakers are all in. Okay, all in. Um, electrical equipment is off. Radio master switch is off. Ignition switch is off. Alternate air is off. Propeller full, mixture idle cutoff, master switch on, alternator on and beacon on. Starting the engines, throttle open one fourth of an inch. Prime, so that means mixture full, fuel pump for five seconds, five, four, three, two, one, and mixture lean. Now let's check prop area is clear, ignition switch both, then start to engage and mixture rich. Okay, clear, again. Okay, now it started. Travel to 1000 RPM. Okay. All pressure checked. Mixture lean. Flaps up. Annunciator panel tested. Okay. Radio master switch on. Okay, check, check, final four. Here we are. Transponder should be set to standby. Okay, standby. Amionic set and tested, and clearance obtained, we assume it. Now let's do the taxiing. Taxi checklist parking brake release, nav lights uh, on, taxi lights on. Brakes and steering and flight instruments should be checked. So that are we doing during the flight. So we're taxiing to the left. Now we see, okay, here the instruments are working. We're taxiing here around and check the brakes. Okay, the brakes are checked. Okay, now we're taxiing little rough driving of the BMW here and now here out to this holding point and here we're doing our before start checklist okay before start here stop the aircraft before I start check this, parking brake is set, fuel selector set to the fullest tank, which is the left tank, okay. Mixture full rich, propeller high, throttle to 2000 RPM. Here we are, 2000 RPM. Now we do the magneto check. First to the right. Okay. First now to the both again and to the left. Okay, and back to both again. 
we have no drop more than 150 and the difference between left and right is not more than 50. So now cycle the prop. Okay, cycle it in again. Okay, the vacuum ammeter uh, checked, engine gauges are checked. Annunciator panel checked. Shuttle 1000. Flight instrument set. Okay, altitude is okay. Uh, heading is set to the heading. Uh, flight controls are free and free and correct. Flap set for takeoff. Trim set for takeoff. Boost pump on. Strobe and landing lights on. All temperature checked. And cylinder head temperature checked. More than 20, 250. Yeah, here we are. Parking brake release. Okay. This was uh, the pre flights. Uh, in the next episode, I will show you how. We will do the takeoff. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you've got any questions, comments or remarks, please post them in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Have a nice day and happy landings.